So here I am in Guadalajara, and I'm here for the Realty Executives Convention, and across the street is sort of a bus stop, except for the beautiful horse garden carriages. Aren't they pretty? Very, very pretty. And you can take a ride around the city. And then this magnificent older church. I don't know if it's the oldest in town, but it's certainly beautiful. And this magnificent fountain. And the courtyard. And it's Saturday afternoon, getting towards evening. There are the gardens. It's just a very pretty, peaceful, pleasant place. We gotta get a picture. There's my friend Allie here in Guadalajara, and she's helping us get on our horse ride. <laughs> And there's my friends, John and Kathy, they're the brokers from Puerto Penasco. And there's the horsey. Pull your zipper up too. Hi from Guadalajara. Here we, we just go. finished our Realty Executives Convention. This is my friend Jerry. Kathy's taking a picture. And we're going to go on a horse carriage yeah. ride. Hi sis, I know how much you love horse drawn carriages. There's the horse. Here come the rest of the realty executives. All getting ready for breakfast or for lunch. So this is the restaurant San Miguel Archangel, St. Michael the Archangel. And isn't this just the neatest place? Look at this. This is where we're having our closing luncheon. Look at that chandelier. And the beautiful walls. I don't know yet if this was an old church or not. But it's certainly a lovely, lovely, lovely location. Hi, everybody! <laughs> hey, hi, Carol! <laughs> Hi, Steve. Hi there. Okay. This is gorgeous. We don't even care if the food's any good. Just being here is going to be fun. Here we are in Lackey Packy, and there's my first organ grinder. Is that fun? This is still in Laki Paki and we ran into some sort of Sunday night street fair full of all kinds of food vendors and all kinds of stuff and obviously a lot of people and it just seems to be the happening place to be tonight. Is that cool? And this is the town square in Laki Paki. It's pretty. Oh, and there's the puppy. We gotta see the puppy. Okay, Bob, this is the couch we're getting. Okay. That's the couch, and your chair's gonna match, but the, it's gonna be tall. And it's gonna be this color. Okay. That's my friend Enrique, who brought me here. Hola, Enrique. And this is the senor who's making it. Okay. Hope you like it, because it's coming in one month, or 21 days. Here I am at the Concurso Nacional de Labrado, Labrado in Cantera. Okay, the 
the concourse of laborers in Pantera. I got here because they had to move me at the hotel, but this is way cool. Way, way, way cool. There's the government palace in the background, and all of these stalls where people are actually making carvings of stone. And that's really cool. Um, in a minute, I'm going to go show you some really cool stuff. But this is the long shot. So here's one of the booths. And oops, there goes a the guy. But anyway, look at the detail on some of these. I mean, isn't that cute? And around here, he's done a great virgin of Guadalupe. And there's the artist at work. I have no idea what that big block of stone is going to be. But, and as I mentioned before, this whole square is lined with them. Very interesting designs. So this is kind of a cool way to spend my last afternoon. Oops, I almost missed this. It's a great statue of um, Miguel Hidalgo, who was the priest who started the revolution. You can see he's got the, or not the revolution, the War of Independence. We don't call it the revolution. And if you look, you can see in his hand the broken chains breaking the bondage of the Mexi uh, Mexico by the Spaniards. Cool, huh? And just one block over I found another square. This grand church, which appears to be closed. It'd be kind of neat to see the inside. And across from the church is this really neat bandstand. Look at the ironwork on that, that's amazing. And then right across the street is the Municipal Palace, still decorated for the Bicentennial. So this is really cool. So sights of Guadalajara. Tomorrow we return to Cabo San Lucas and we'll be shooting beaches, but in the meantime, this is pretty cool.